Hey everybody, TTM Troy here, and today we are going to be talking about finding high resolution images for prints. I did a video <laughs> a couple weeks ago about printing photos, but I thought I'd do a quick video on how to find photos, and I actually use Google Images. And I'm gonna just do a sample here. Um, a lot of people are a big fan of the Netflix show Stranger Things. It's been really popular lately. So I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm gonna search Google Images for that title. And I'm actually gonna use Stranger Things Netflix just to make sure that I, I get the right things. So that's gonna pull up the search results. And if you hover over each of these images, you can actually see the resolution. Here it is 585 by 330. Um, if you go to some of these other ones and hover over them, you'll see that they have various quality. Here's a 790, that's probably not too good. This one's close. That one's probably marginal. But what you're looking for is a very high resolution image. So I'm gonna click on search tools and I'm gonna go down to size and pull down larger than and I'm gonna choose two megapixels. So this is gonna show me images that are fairly big. And what that means is they will actually make better eight by 10 prints. And smaller images are good for four by sixes, but two megapixels is pretty good for eight by 10. So this would be a great photo to send to her for uh, an autograph. Um, if I look up, you could also choose larger than four megapixels. And that brings up some good images like Winona Ryder. This one is a little bit too big for an eight by 10. There's Matthew Modine. I uh, don't know that kid's name. He's the one that gets goes missing. This might be good for all four for a multi-signed. And uh, here's another big one. But all of these are greater than four megapixels, but I'm gonna go back to two. And uh, this one in particular would make a great photo to have signed. You could crop off the bottom and the Netflix logo and make it an actual eight by 10 and it would make a good multi-signed item. You could also do this for sports figures. So I'm gonna go ahead and type in JJ Watt and you'll notice it kept my larger than two megapixels here. And just going through these, you can see that there, oh, there's the one that I actually have on a card. And so this is a pretty good image. So I'm gonna click on view image and then I could actually save that to my desktop and upload that to Sharp Prints. So go ahead and close that. But it really works on any picture that you would want to get either eight by tens of, you could do four by sixes. Um, that way you can get even larger prints if, if you want. I know Stacey Schaefer likes or used to like uh, doing those larger prints, but that is basically how I get higher resolution images. And uh, when I do get autographs, I upload them to my website. And if you've never been here, please check it out, ttmautograph.com. I actually upload all high resolution scans of my returns to the website. And you could, I also, also obviously upload my videos, there's my last TTM tip. My videos are all on the side. And you can just see that uh, basically the website has all high resolution images of the autographs that I put in all my videos. So please check it out. Spend a lot of time on this, but not a lot of people go to it. <laughs> Especially I like my football cards by team section that has all the logos. Um, there's Buffalo Bills. Oops, go back. And uh, let's go to the Texans here that has the JJ Watt on it click on that and there's the photo right there. I think that's the same one or similar. So anyway, check out ttmautograph.com. Uh, thanks everybody. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy these videos because I really appreciate everybody. Um, I, you know, you you guys are the reason I do this because I want to help other collectors and you know, I enjoyed the hobby and I want you to enjoy the hobby as well. So uh, hopefully this video gave you a little bit of insight on how to find the best pictures for your eight by tens or your four by sixes, whatever you choose to do. And uh, yeah, like I said, please share this with uh, people you might find or who might find this interesting. So anyway, that's it for today's TTM Tuesday tip with TTM Troy. Check out my article later on Mike the Fanboy. I have some new 
address is there. And I hope everybody has a giant mail day. Talk to you later, guys. Bye-bye.